and highlight the ministry of reconciliation. So reconciliation means to be brought back, means to be restored. I want you to know that there are so many people that need brought back to the power, to the love, to the admonition of the Father. There's so many people that need brought back to the place that God has for them because they feel like they're too washed up. They feel like they're too far gone. They feel like they, they've, they've done messed up too much that God can't accept them because they were a new person and they are a new person, but they've tried to live. See, here's the problem, church. Come on, somebody say, here's the problem. You're trying to live the new life in the old way. Amen. You can't do it the same way you did it before you got saved. If somebody ran their mouth, I'd bust them in the mouth. When I gave my heart to Jesus, now I bust them in the mouth with prayer. Hallelujah. I'll say, devil, you can't win. I'm going to pray they get saved. And when they get saved, I'm going to say, nana, nana, boo, boo. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, you can't see me now. What you got to say, devil, you can't win because these people that are coming against me are going to recognize that I I've been reconciled. I've been bought with the price. I'm not the same man that I used to be. That redeeming grace, I've been redeemed. Come on, somebody. Is there anybody in the house tonight that has been redeemed by the blood of Jesus Christ? So he gave us, somebody say he gave us the ministry of reconciliation.